Prograf or tacrolimus, okay. and this is a medication that's going to help prevent rejection of the liver. Okay. And it does that by suppressing the immune system okay. or weakening the immune system. Mm -hmm. Now, the best way to take this medication is to have no food or other medications one hour before or after taking the Prograf. Okay. And it is given twice a day, 12 hours apart. Okay. So here in the hospital, we're giving it at 8 in the morning and 8 at night. But if you do want to change that schedule, you can talk to your coordinator about finding a schedule that's convenient for you when you go home. Okay, so no eating for an hour, take the medication, take Prograf, and then no eating for another hour Correct. after that. Okay. Now, Prograf does come in different formulations. It comes as a five milligram capsule, a one milligram capsule, and a 0.5 milligram capsule. Okay. And if your child needs a liquid form, it does come as a special compounded suspension okay. that you can also use that is needs to be shaken well and kept at room temperature. And then I just um, pull it up in a syringe and shoot it in his mouth so he can swallow it? Correct. Okay. But we will direct you as to what dosage mm -hmm. to be giving your child. Okay. And the dosage will actually be based on drug levels that we will be measuring in the blood. Okay. Now, after transplant, we have certain target goals where we'd like the prograph level to be. Okay. And immediately transplant, usually for the first two weeks, we'd like them between 12 and 15. Okay. And then usually after two weeks, it drops down from 10 to 12, and it can, keeps decreasing the further out transplant he is. Okay. As long as he doesn't have any signs of rejection or infection, which we may decrease or increase the dosage accordingly. Okay. Now, prograph does have drug interactions with other medications as well as other food items. For example, um, certain antibiotics like um, erythromycin, azithromycin, or fluconazole okay. can increase prograph levels, as well as grapefruit or grapefruit juice. Okay. Some side effects of prograph is that it's a great drug in terms of preventing rejection, but it can also weaken the immune system. So your child will be at increased risk for infection. Okay. Prograf can increase the blood pressure. It can also increase the blood sugars. It can cause the body to lose magnesium, so your child may need some magnesium supplements. It can cause tremors or shakes, more noticeable in the hands, mm -hmm. but usually when prograf levels are high. It can cause skin sensitivity, where your child may sunburn more easily. So it is recommended to put sunscreen just to protect the skin and make sure that there's minimal damage to the skin to okay. prevent skin cancer. Okay. And it also increases the risk for infection. 